My name is John O'Halloran, I'm from University College Cork and I'm head of school of the Biological Earth and Environmental Sciences and we're down here in southern Portugal on the Algarve for the 17th time it seems and only yesterday we came down for the first time with groups of students and when you think of that that's nearly 40 students or per annum that's almost 700, 800 students have had this fantastic experience of taking a course outside Ireland in a wonderful habitat that we see here. What's really interesting is the range of habitats um, that we visit in Portugal. Uh, they range from the Mont Chic and the mountains, which go up to higher than Caron Tool in Ireland, over 900 metres, down to the shore, which is right equivalent seashore level as we have in Ireland, uh, looking at the intertidal area, looking at the terrestrial habitats, looking at the lagoon behind me, which is a very rare habitat, which you have these dune slacks, which you can see behind me, these particular water areas, particularly important for migratory birds. It's really critical that we take courses like this where students are exposed to international dimension, where they go out as a class with the staff to an area like this. It's complex in terms of getting people here, in terms of organisation, but the experience is absolutely critical to their learning. So the kind of courses we take are the field-based ones which we've been taking today, looking at ornithology, observing birds, identifying key species, up to looking in the mountains, looking at the landscapes, we're looking at the, both the cultural and historical landscape which have shaped this part of Iberia. And in many ways what we're trying to do is to draw a contrast between what you can see in Ireland and what you can see here. And why might that be important? Well, it's important because when we actually look at the future, perhaps we're under different climate change scenarios, where we have to be able to make some predictions as to what some of the species might be, new species arriving in Ireland that are probably resident here now. So if you forecast in 10 or 15 years, you may well see on a course like this species that would appear in Ireland in the future. And indeed, there will be some that disappear. One particular species we see down here is the corn bunting, which is a, a species of brown, brown bird, if you like, a little brown job, that are very difficult to see. But that bird has become extinct in Ireland. In fact, when we came out here first, the last record that that species were seen in Ireland. So during the duration of this course, that species has disappeared from Ireland. It is now getting scarce here. So we're following the pathways of change that can actually happen during a course like this. I suppose the other really important part of this course is that it gives us, us as a faculty, each of the staff, to work in reasonably small groups. And that means that we can engage in generating new knowledge, doing research, and feeding that directly into the teaching. So this module, the field ecology module, at University College Cork, in an international setting, gives our students and staff an experience to work in new habitats, new places that are exciting, that are uncertain, but actually give us a great deal of contrast to the habitats that exist and occur in Ireland.